one earth cache, two souvenirs, and attacked by wasps. Come join me. So, has anyone ever gotten a DNF on an earth cache? Well, I did it a couple of years ago, but that's going to provide me an opportunity to have a nice local cache to uh, try and fill out my uh, road trip 2015 and uh, get two of the two of the souvenirs. There's actually a couple of things that would make interesting earth caches. Up above uh, on the roadway, there's a stream that runs pretty regularly, a little spring, and it uh, deposits limestone. And here on the bridge structure, you can see some of that limestone. As a matter of fact, even coming right out of that little uh, drainage hole right there, we've got some limestone uh, working down and, and actually building up here. On the, on the grass. Pretty little pool between these two canyons, really narrow. It still has a lot of water in it, but about as low as I've ever seen it. Okay, so according to the GPS, we are here. And let's see what we can see. Okay, gonna be real honest, because when I'm over there by that rock, I'm 37 feet away. When I'm over at this rock, I'm 37 feet away. I don't know if he's talking about these layerings here, or, since he does talk about the fact that this has been turned up almost vertical, is he talking about that layering there? And uh, that's a little frustrating for me. Or is he even talking about this, which is layered? Could have been turned up vertically, but it's not near the coordinates. But frustration or no frustration? I have to say, this is a beautiful place to visit, some place many people don't even know that exists, even though there's a highway right up there and hundreds, perhaps thousands of people every day drive right over this canyon. So, so thanks Terry Dad for bringing me out here, even though it has been a certain frustration in the experience. Okay, so this area right underneath the bridge, I'm not going to show it to you because I don't want to give away the... Uh, but it just absolutely makes perfect sense to me. We're at the river bottom. Uh, there's very clear layers. They've been lifted up uh, vertically, and I can count the number of layers. So I'm just gonna go over that, and uh, we'll see what happens. So that just went from frustrating to not fun at all, because on the way back, I stirred up a hornet's nest. I did not stop and get any video of it, um, as they attacked me severely. Um, so now I'm going to do what they recommend. Some of them have left stingers in me, and I'm going to pluck those out with a credit card. That was Squeezing them and squeezing more of the poison in. But that's the second time in my life I've had that happen. And that is just no fun at all.